I'm demonstrating here um, our UPVC sash windows, sometimes called box sash windows. This is a special order cream finish. We take wood grain and spray the wood grain so you've got a wood effect, it doesn't show up very well unless you're close to it. You've got a wood grain effect in cream. Um, obviously all double glazed and I'll demonstrate shortly how the various mechanisms work. We offer this delivered on a nationwide basis, so that includes Scotland obviously. Um, we have difficulty with um, the offshore islands and one of the major difficulties is the, the weights. They are a very, very, very heavy window, uh, very heavy indeed. They do replicate uh, virtually exactly what a timber box sash looks like. Um, although there's a number of improvements, obviously it's PVC so there's no maintenance, the double glaze, they're fully draft proofed. You know, box sash windows tend to be painted up and never reopened <coughs> um, over the years. That is, we have um, obviously a wood grain window, and it has what we call an astragal bar. So we have here one double glazing unit, but in the middle of the double glazing unit is or are two spacer bars joined together back to back. And then this astragal bar, <coughs> excuse me, is applied on the front and the back to give a divided light appearance. Sometimes you'll have the astragal bar just in the top. It depends what your existing windows are like and, and what you're looking to replicate. Sometimes in the top um, and sometimes in both. But the alternative to astragal bar is Georgian bar. So you'll have seen on the price list, on the pricing software, we're offering astragal bars, single astragal bar, that's what it means. Georgian is where the units are split up even more, and that's priced as Georgian. Simple as that. And moving on to that, there's a Georgian unit. And we can maybe get in <coughs> a little bit closer and show you exactly, because it's not too apparent on that, but we can maybe show you um, what this, the Americans call it true divided light. Um, we can show you what the Georgian looks like. So again, exterior applied Georgian bars um, and spacer bars in between to give that true divided light appearance. I better be careful using that phrase because if an American window company who actually um, have it registered, they'll be suing me, you know what the Americans are like. But these windows as you can see aren't fitted yet, they're actually for the showroom um, and we will be fitting them in the fullness of time. Um, but that's how they work, you can see there, now this is you know, a window that isn't fitted, and it's a very very heavy window I can assure you, uh, and that is a very very nice action. I have to be a little bit careful with this operation because um, of the weight, but both the top and the bottom drop in for cleaning. Now if this window was fixed I could demonstrate that on both of them, but it's not. Um, so you disengage, push the two catches in and tilt either panel out and then re-engage them. Now, <coughs> it's very, very, very important, I don't know whether it was demonstrated there, um, the window has to be engaged correctly. If it isn't engaged correctly, if it's half engaged, as I did there, that can fall out. So you have to make sure you get that click and they move in. That's very, very important. If you don't do that, and we have had an instance in an office um, where that happened, um, we 
recommend that you don't allow staff cleaners to do that. I'm not quite sure how you're going to stop them doing it, but you know, perhaps a, um, a warning notice to say slide up and down only. Not quite what you could do there, but you'll have to be careful with that. And then, windows locked.